What is up guys, Dub here, and welcome to Top of Billy Drafts number 10, and uh, I'm just going to give you guys a heads up. If you're already looking at the field, you know what my first pick is going to be. I am number one in the draft, and there's permanent visibility in the field, and this is a complete shit show. Um, after I fully edited this video already, I always do the commentary after, and it's really, really hard for me to take myself seriously. But let's go ahead and try it anyways. Um, so we're going to go ahead, obviously, I'm first pick, so I get my first pick at whatever the fuck I want. And there's only one tier one pick. And uh, if you don't know tier one, you probably haven't watched me stream or watch many of these videos. Um, basically, in Ability Draft, there's really only three or four skills that are absolute first picks. Things like permanent visibility, coup de gras, chemical rage, things of that sort uh, that are just so fucking broken on different characters. It's stupid. Or in multiple characters. So in this case, permanent visibility is the only one. Permanent invis invisibility makes us obviously permanently invisible unless we attack. And also lets us do magical techs. Um, you know, without being shown. So, uh, end goal here, we're going to go ahead and flip up to the next time I get a pick. Um, that being said, like, I mean, we'll be invisible. We can do as many magic spells as we want. Well, these dipshits gave me um, a lot of really good spells I can do. Most importantly being Finger of Death, Lion's Ultimate. I'm an intelligence hero. So I already have pretty good magic regen. I'm invisible. And now you cannot live. Period. Done. I'm also getting Storm Hammer. It's really good stun. Uh, AoE damage. The Scepter, or Agonim Scepter on top of Finger of Death makes it even scarier. So we're going to go ahead and I got Finger of Death. Next round happens. Storm Hammer. And we're going to go ahead and go to the next pick. So, uh, guys, for this next pick, we are just looking at basically another magic spell. Uh, there's a couple things I could have went with here. I could have gone with Dual Breath. Um, I mean, I could have gone with the Smoke, uh, Smoke of Deceit, or whatever it's called, the Ricky Smoke. I ended up going with Plasma Field. Um, a really safe, another really good AoE at this point. All my spells are AoE, so it does really good. This actually really helps me clear Creep Waves. Uh, but you guys are going to see, I, I mean... I'm broken. This is a broken lineup, guys. I'm not going to even joke about this. This is one reason why Ability Draft is just sad. Um, I mean, you're going to see, don't get me wrong. If you look up on the top, Drow has a really good build. A Vengeance or a Precision or a War Cry. God Strength. She is going to be scary. Luna's kind of fucked up and she messed a couple things up. But hey, that's okay. We're going to go ahead and scroll. I actually already have a couple kills. I think I have two kills already. But just to give you an idea of what the combinations I'm going to be pulling off look like, it looks a little like this. And, uh, yeah. Just to give you guys a heads up, um, I finished with over 30 kills. And I only actually die once. So yeah, we're going to go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and shut off my recording on the audio and uh, just let you watch the shit show. just sit there and play all these videos over and over um, because it kind of gets the point across. I did want to show my one actual death this game, which I could have suicided. I was just a little slow to do it. Um, this game, I ended up going 32 in 3, I believe. There's two Bloodstone suicides in there. Um, that was that very end there, the actual legitimate death. You can see me kind of mocking a little bit. But yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching these videos. Uh, top Ability Drafts have been one of my top series I've been doing Rizzo recently, and they're actually really fun to do. Um, gives me, you know, something fun I can always do. It's always different. But thank you so much, guys. Comment below of just broken drafts you've had before and things that you, you know, have experienced. And uh, let me know. Anyways, I'll talk to you later. Peace.